And alright guys, what is going on? Welcome back to another vlog on the David Hammond YouTube channel. Oh my gosh guys, I haven't said that in probably about a year's time or maybe like six months, eight months. I have no clue guys, how are you doing? It's been a while, I know I look tired, I'm sorry. I have some pre-workout, it's, it's been an interesting past couple months guys, which is part of the reason I have not been vlogging. I've just been going through a lot of stuff and evolving and changing my ideas. Uh, and recently, about two days ago, I had the inspiration to, uh, you know, pick up the camera again and uh, maybe we'll speak a little bit more about that as time goes on and yeah guys I feel like there's a lot of stuff coming up this summer it's gonna be amazing and I want to document that uh, with you guys to sharpen my skills again on how to communicate <laughs> And uh, yeah, a bunch of stuff. So anyways, guys, it is 3.30 right now, 3.45. I woke up at 11.30, so uh, we're back on the cut, guys. I've been cutting for about one week's time. I'll actually put up some overlays right here, guys. I am 197. Now, I maybe you can tell by looking at my face, I have never weighed that much, I think, my entire life. So it's time to cut, time to lose like 10 to 12 pounds, get down to around one mid 80s. Will I compete at 83 kg? I don't even know if I'm gonna compete, period, in a while. Powerlifting has been going very well, guys. We actually have a big PR coming up later today for leg day. There's a lot to update you guys on. It's been a minute. Uh, but anyways, let me eat this. We'll uh, go for a walk, kind of update you guys on a bunch of things, get up to speed, get it going, and then we'll get some more time lapses. Clean in the kitchen, gotta post some videos, had a call this morning. Just get the day going, guys. Day in the life of self development entrepreneurship David and I'll see you guys then Time lapse is done, meal prep, cha-ching, had some chicken, tuna, a little bit of rice. I don't even think I told you guys what I ate. High protein diet, you guys know what's up. Clean the kitchen, gave it a good clean, man. Haven't mopped the floors in a little bit of time. Won't lie, so it was definitely in need of that. Anyways, guys, actually just drinking some BCAs right here, finishing it off a little bit of pre-workout to wake up. And let's chat, man. Let's chat, guys. You know, you can see it in my eyes. I look very tired and kind of drained and burnt out. And uh, you know, this was part of the reason I stopped vlogging. I mean, there are many reasons, guys. Number one, you guys know that we are on something called monk mode. And yes, I'm buttoning up my jacket. It's cold today. It's been so warm in the past few days, but today it's, it's kind of cold. Uh, so monk mode, guys, you know I'm single. I've been celibate now for over a year. Uh, we completed monk mode for over a year, like I said. And the first 10 months or so were honestly, I'm not gonna say they were a breeze, but it was pretty straightforward. Learning the word of God, knowing myself, building things up, think of like a tower, right? Where I would say the past two months or so, coming around the year mark, I feel like I began to get tested. Almost like, you guys know I follow Christ and uh, that's part of monk mode, almost like I was studying for the exam the first 10 months and then the past two months were like the final test. And yeah, it just feels like I've been going through a lot of spiritual warfare, a lot of things, uh, there's been a lot of confusion and I'm not quitting or giving up or anything like that guys, in fact we've only just begun. But I feel as of late, certain things I've been testing my faith and uh, yeah, there's just been a lot of that as of late. But on the pro, you guys know there's always an upside, I believe that happens and through looking back the past year, the times where I've gotten attacked or tested, we could say, right? The most were always just before the blessing. We're always just before you pass the test. And that's exactly how it feels right now, guys. You see, guys, no matter who you are on your path of self-development, monk mode, you could say, and excuse the wind, you will get tested. You will go through seasons where you uh, doubt your faith a bit in God and you doubt your faith in yourself and you doubt your faith in a lot of things. You just, out of nowhere, you guys know in Ephesians 6 12 we do not fight against flesh and blood but against spiritual wickedness meaning the warfare is in our mind the warfare is not so much tangible but it's spiritual which I know for some of you guys is kind of hard to grasp it's a, it's a strange concept but when your life breaks down you know that's that's not coincidence I believe just like in the book of Job God allows that to happen uh, to test you and just like in the book of Job if you endure with your faith right you will get back everything doubled so that's how it's been feeling as of late and again this is not to look for sympathy or you know to think I'm not gonna be okay I've gone through this many times you know I'll be completely fine I say this to let you guys know that we endure as warriors of Christ we are commanded to endure to keep going don't give up don't lose faith take it one day at a time 
and eventually you will begin to see, you know guys, we can only connect the dots looking backwards. You will see how this all makes sense, how it builds you as a man, and I know this is no different, you know, I've been through this many times, and I'm sure you guys have. So with that, we have leg day, let's hit a PR, 425 for a triple at like RPE9, I'll let you guys know after the gym if we get it, and then I'll see you guys back home, do the outro, just like the good old days, and yeah, hope we do these once a week. So let's go, gym B-roll clip, leg day, in three, two, one, go. Nowadays, nothing really is ice cream. Only one of me and nobody's like me. Phone ringing and I tell him it's ice. I got wifey on, blinging blinking sheet. Ice freeze, freeze, freeze. Photo. photo, photo, please, please. no photos. No, no, Jeez. Jeez. no, 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 please, no photos. Hit the door and the dome and just whole team here, money some. Venomous. Still young, but I move like a Veteran. new deal to my lawyer. To if you're down in my management, I'm just warming up a way to lie. Old producers saw the numbers one. Venomous. Different colors in my baggy life. Chalk it up, talk of the town where you're talking up. Wanna get you a ring and you tough enough. Wanna get you new things with your pockets dull. Run it up. I used to be quiet and out of luck. Now I move up and move humble cause that hate and the jealousy. My mama telling me count up your blessings and run it up. Nowadays, nothing really is ice cream. Only one of me and nobody. Like me. Phone ringing and I tell him it's ice. I got wifey on bling and she ice. Freeze, freeze, photo, photo, please, please. no photos, no, no, jeez, no, 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 please, no photos. I keep giving game away, I put game on layaway. I got paid to play today, I get paid to stay away. I get paid on rainy days, I might make it rain today. I got paid off pain today, thought it take the pain away. In my own lane, finger roll. I would never sell my only soul. Heard your whole team was for sale. Heard it's on the market for the low. Who the realest we might never know. All this acting, you gon' play a role. Give you the world when they sign you up. Try you out and then they line you up. Ooh. Now you're looking hungry, ribs are touching, need some food. Now you're all on live acting, surprised, but you was fooled. Boy, get out the way, it's been a day, now you're old news. Now you got the pen and pad, you're trying to take my. What is up guys, how you doing post leg day? Yes, this is not my camera, this used to be my old camera, hence the audio, it's not great. This is the homie Logan. What's good, yo, what's good? We're gonna, you guys are gonna see a lot more of him, Rob, and the homie Nick, guys. We're a little bit younger, uh, outside Osmos, gonna get some food in this dish, guys. We got a massive leg day PR, and uh, let's go, because it's windy. All right guys, so, Osmos is one of the only places open till 11 o'clock and we finished pretty late powerlifting. We were there for probably what, like three hours? Yep. Yeah, we got there at 6.30, it's 10.30, so that's actually four hours. So we gonna get, what are we gonna get, Logan? Um, I got a pure team. Okay, oh, okay. Uh, you got chicken, chicken, what, chicken. What am I gonna do? Uh, probably a bullshit brand. Yes. No. <laughs> no wrap? No, chick, chicken on the rocks. All right, guys, checking in with that mother flipping. Oh, dang, he blessed it. Let's go, baby, he knew. That is chicken, I believe. It kind of looks like beef, but it's chicken. I got mine first because they like me more. I'm the largest one here, but anyways, time lapse, let's go. And all right, guys, we are back home. Let's get it going. I think it's like 1 o'clock, 1.15. Been fixing my sleep schedule as of the past few days to a week, I want to say. It's when I began the cut. Springs here guys. It's like mid-April at this point. It's really time to just Tighten things up solidify things no more excuses no more playing Dark Souls late at night I did that for a while but a month and a half to be brutally honest I kind of like I told you guys was in a funk this past month and a half and I knew why I was doing it I was uh, trying to numb myself and escape my problems um, Which is you know for a time and place It's okay as long as you're aware of it, but you realize that there is a root issue and only ourselves and God can fix that. So that's what I'm trying to do right now, guys. And I believe it's working moving forward, you know, to finish it up here, guys. And hopefully you enjoyed the B-roll clip I filmed with the young guy, Logan. Logan and Rob are kind of like my two sons. If they're watching this, they probably will try to disagree, but they're kind of like, the little guys I like to mentor and coach, so you'll see a lot of them. They're kind of my only friends, to be honest. I don't really have friends anymore. That's kind of an update for you guys. I never did, but yeah, I don't really have friends, period. Being on monk mode. <laughs> but uh, anyways, one thing, a revelation that I just gained, like literally 10 minutes ago while I was eating, is God humbled me this past month and a half. And I think that's what was happening. I was growing kind of prideful, I'll be honest with you guys. You know, in my feats of... Oh, being on monk mode for a year and you know doing certain things that most others don't do and I caught myself subconsciously kind of viewing myself you know more superior than the average person which is not Christ like at all because who am I I'm, I'm, I'm dirt compared to Christ I'm literally a little peasant we're all sinners and I got humbled I'm gonna finish this vlog with this quote from Matthew I believe it's 
2313 or something like that. And those who exalt themselves, which means to raise you on the rank, right? To, to be exalted, to be put higher in the hierarchy. Those who exalt themselves will be humbled, but those who humble themselves will be exalted. And that is fact, guys. As I look at the great wave, like I always do, I have a massive feeling that these next few months and years, especially with summer coming up, it's gonna be this massive trajectory. And we gotta be ready. We gotta be humble, man. I can't, God knows, I can't be prideful going on all these podcasts. And fun fact, I did a podcast with a couple of guys who are older than me, and that's where I caught myself being super prideful. I, I was, it's not that what I was saying was wrong. It was like statistically correct, but it was without love. Do you know what I mean? Was, I was kind of being like a Pharisee, like a religious spirit, just, oh, you know, to the book, da 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 kind of like snotty nosed or prideful. And it was a bad look. I looked at it afterwards and I apologized. I was like, this is, this is not good. So yeah, uh, I think that's kind of the point of this vlog. That's why I've been going through. It's so awesome making these videos too, because like, I think I realized that because I made this vlog. I could hear myself out loud. This past month and a half, I think what God was trying to do was beat me down, which was humbling me to get pride out of my system. So anyways, guys, that is it. I hope you enjoyed the first vlog back in a minute, in a very long time. Thank you guys. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give it a thumbs up, comment, subscribe. I'll finish it here, guys, with the one final plug. If you guys wanna work with me, I still do offer coaching. It's actually the only plug at the moment I do offer. So if you guys are serious, you know what's up. Book a call below where we can speak on topics just just like this monk mode or on a more practical level improving things like your fitness business mindset and relationships that is it you can support edge coupon code hammond yes we're still working with edge guys after all this time and that's it all right check you guys next vlog more b-roll clips more drone clips more documentation let's keep growing see you guys then much love peace